So in this tutorial, we're going to see how to get data from an Excel file like this one and um, create the PC view configuration. Basically here, the use case is an Excel file with some device information, description, name, and some properties. And uh, we need to get all this data to create our PC view configuration. In PC view, the first thing to do is from the application explorer, from the general menu, file references to create a file reference to your Excel file. So you create a name, my Excel file. So this name is very important because it's the one used uh, later in the configuration. And you set the file path of this file. That's it, so now the file is uh, referenced in PC view. Now, the next step is to use the application architect. The application architect is the modeling, the template modeling tool of PC view to create template of object and then generate the configuration from, uh, from the tool. So the first, first step is to create a template like here, so I create a template for a device, for example. And this device, I add a variable. So I register, for example, temp in for temperature. And now, this is when we get uh, the data from the Excel. So here we want to uh, have a description and several properties. If I take a look to the Excel file, I see that the description is here in column six and the name of the device in column five and some other properties such as unity, scale and so on are here, for example, 35 for degree C. So, one very uh, simple way to get a specific cellular text from Excel is an expression in the application, uh, the application architect. So here you right click and you define an expression. And this expression is one expression of Excel. So you can go to the help, search for Excel and pick up the first topic, which is referencing an Excel file in an expression. And here you have several expressions to be used. So in this tutorial, uh, we're going to see the first one, the Excel get cell, which basically allows to get one specific cell value from Excel. And then we're going to see also the Excel VLOOKUP. Uh, which allows to search in a given column uh, a value and then returns uh, from this search uh, specific value. So let's start with the first expression. I copy past here. I can remove here the option. I won't use it. And the first argument is the file reference. Basically the name we uh, entered for the file reference my excel file the second argument is the name of the sheet of excel so if we check here this is devices base so I copy paste this name here and then i just indicate the row and the column index to get the value from. For example, if I want uh, this value, this is 6 and row 13. So 13 and 6. Now I can create, create an instance of my model like this. 
um, device. Okay, and I can check that the expression is resolved and I got in the description temperature input eg primary bottle which is exactly the description I have here uh, in column 6 row 13 and if I generate PCV configuration you can check in the application explorer variable trees I do have a new temp device temperature with the right description so I got the description from the from the Excel file now I can do something more generic for example if I want to get description but also unity and some other properties for all uh, specific cell beginning with T T one one and with slash E so I want to get description or uh, unity for example for tt11 slash e but also for tt112 slash e in this case i have to uh, do a lookup of uh, this text so let's have a look how to do it in um, in uh, pc view so now i just delete remove this device and i change my template so here I'm going to use another expression which is Excel V lookup. I remove the option, I don't want to use it for the demo. The reference is still the name of my reference. Same for name devices base and here I indicate the lookup index and the lookup value so basically the text I want to search and where I want to search V for vertical so what is the colon I want to search for so it's the colon 5 here and I search for this uh, text so it's column 5 and the text is tt111 slash e and when I found this text I want to return the value of uh, this column, column 6 so here let's say column six. Okay. So in this case, if I create an instance of my device, device one, and if I check the expression, I get the right description, which is good. So now let's go further now I want to create something more generic means I want to get all the TT11 TT11 um, text but directly from the instances so I can change this remove the text and say okay I want to get the name of the instance template instance dot name plus slash e and this way I will be able to get all the tt111 slash e but I need to create the instance with the name here so if I create an instance tt111 I got the right description for TTY1 
now if I copy paste this instance for TT112, I got the right expression for the TT112 secondary bottle here. So this way I create something able to get the value depending on the instance name. So if I check the Here in the Excel file, Excel file, I have those cell with those this expression, and with the same technique, I can get the unit text, for example. So I take exactly the same expression, but now I got. For the name, not six, colon six, but colon thirty-five. Okay, let's check here what we have in expression for the first degree C and the second degree C. Now if we generate and check in the application explorer, we have our two element is the temperature and description and unit and automatically from PCView and from the Excel file. 